Louisa. back from my weekend shenanigans it's wednesday by the way i got a package from restyle by arch my number one plug for anything outfit okay um this are uh, gowns i don't know i'm not going to be able to do a haul i just want to show you guys have this um i also got this oh my god yeah so the packaging is Love it.
been a week since I last picked up my camera to vlog. Like a week today. The last time you guys saw me was last week Wednesday. Um, I've just been, I don't know, going through it. I'm not, I don't want to nag about like my mood and stuff like that. But then I have this attack. I call it an attack because I don't know where the sauce is from. Uh, texture, this very disgusting texture on my face is just rough and very very patchy and you know I did my research um, because that's uh, the first thing I do is research finding out what the problem is so I'm hearing is you know dry skin texturized skin uh, dermatitis which has been reoccurring for a while now um, I'm really scared of facials honestly because I've seen what facials can do especially when you go to a place that is not right right so um, there's that so I got a cream E45 I'll show you guys in a bit um i've been using it for two days not much of a difference but it just feels good to know that i've been working on it then i've also been battling with um body dysmorphia and that's one of the things that i do battle with a lot like right from time even when i was not at the weight i am in now i used to com consistently complain about what i look like and how i feel about my weight so that's really putting me off as well um what else that's pretty much it that's the reason why so today i have decided to start working out actually i didn't decide today i want to start on monday but i've been procrastinating honestly and i'm just scared like what if i start and i don't continue it's going to be useless why not just rest you know it's just a lot of noise in my head well not noise in that aspect but just like back and forth so um i want to try to see if i can work out well not work out work out just something light honestly i just want to be able to put on my workout clothes I just see what I can do. I feel like it would be a win for me today. And then tomorrow, we just take the day as it goes. I've been struggling with sleeping early because I have a night plan that I'm not going to watch waste. So at night, I try to, you know, catch up with my favorite YouTubers because of the free data. <laughs> Shameless, but whatever. So um, that's what I do. So it's been a struggle. But yesterday, I tried my best to at least close my eye by 12 a.m. And I set my alarm for 6.30. So I feel, still feel a bit tired because I didn't get my eight hours eight hours of sleep but um guys this is the cream i was talking to you guys about it's the e45 cream i was just taking a walk the other day and i went to a pharmacy to buy water and i just stumbled on it on the shelf and most of the problems they talked about was what i was facing so i decided to try it out i'll let you guys know if it eventually works um so yeah i just want to try my best to walk out do something move at least i just feel like if i continue saying or oh, like giving excuses i'm never ever going to do it so and i started alternate day fasting as well today because um it's just the fastest way to lose weight honestly it might not be the healthiest which that's debatable but it's the fastest and it might not be sustainable but i will do it for a while and then find what works eventually um the goal here is to build up my speed up my metabolism and you know just try to eat more whole foods and then move be more active um yeah so let's let's see let's try and see if we can move let's just let's just see hi guys that was such a good workout like my mood is automatically lifted i just feel like the key to procrastination is just do it and even if you don't meet your target on that first day i feel like it's still productive all the same it's still better than lying down on the bed two four seven i'm going to go for a walk this evening as i've started that two days ago but i did want this morning boost so i feel good i'll leave a link to the workout that i did in the description box it's about 20 minutes not too intense really nice it's just a mood booster if you ask me so i'm going to just arrange my environment i want to wash my clothes but honestly i don't have strength i don't so um i'm just going to arrange my bed try to watch tv work you guys know i'm into social media management now so i'm going to do i already wrote a caption that i was supposed to do today so i'll just have to upload it and yeah that's pretty much how my day is going to be i'll talk to you guys if anything Fun is happening.
How you guys doing? Just checking in on you guys. You guys saw when I had um, breakfast, right? Yeah, you guys saw that. And I finished doing my makeup. I just finished filming a video that I think you guys are going to like. By the time this vlog goes up, that video should be up already. So help me run it. Um, I'm about to arrange my room. It's a mess here. You guys know whenever I film, it's always a mess. Um, but yeah, I wanted to pop in and show you guys how beautiful I look because my vlogs. And this, I'm always looking like a mad woman. But yeah, this is what I look like. Um, I'm hungry I want to have lunch and then I'll talk to you guys very much like much later Hi guys um what's up it's been so long since I talked to you guys um, my skin was under a massive attack like I just feel like I wish I had done this video when I was so upset but I've calmed down now but I just want to pass across a message you see this product anywhere you see it run this product destroyed my skin destroyed my face if you look at the corner of my mouth you can still see the hyperpigmentation going on my chest is devoured like the ph of this thing is ridiculous i had to go search online which it was the biggest mistake of my life that i made and i'm so mad at myself because as someone who knows about skincare i should have known better i should have you know um you know at least found out the ph of the product i was going to buy and remember if you watch my vlogs i think in the last vlog that's when i purchased uh, this product just randomly off the shelf i just said let me just try something new this product and another one cent i've put once an eyes product i'm going to put it on the screen has destroyed my skin this is the second time don't ever buy this product don't ever buy this product i didn't realize how bad it was until i started using it on my face then my skin was destroyed my my face was as rough as foot mat not anyhow foot mat to the one you keep outside that's how rough my face is but now it has calmed down and you know it's getting better i'm going to do a video of what i used to you know heal that another product you should never ever 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 use is this sunscreen i don't know how i just got my hands on it the white cast no be here like one drop in eh? looks like calamine lotion don't ever use this i'm going to throw this away this is not even good for giving someone it's not even good for your enemy so i'm going to throw it away these two products absolutely useless in fact i'm not even saying this thing very well i'm not even as i don't feel like i'm saying it very well but that's what it is i got a couple new products which honestly i don't even want to come and post it here because i don't even know what it's going to do to my skin but after a week if i see good results then i'll show you guys what i got very recently but um yeah my skin is healing so i can finally talk to you guys when my skin is not right everything is not right like i couldn't go out i even did makeup and my the rough texture as in was so visible in the makeup see you guys don't know what i went through this past week i was like i'm traumatized seriously i'm not exaggerating i'm traumatized but um yeah i it looks like i'm sweating but i'm not i got this hydrating cream because my, my skin needs all the water that you can get right now i'm going to do a an in-depth video of what to do when your skin's ph has been messed up if you want to see that leave me a comment down below if i get like 10 comments i will do it if i don't then i will just leave it because i'll assume that nobody wants to see that tomorrow i have a shoot with a new designs i have a shoot and i think i'll end that vlog tomorrow i wanted to edit it today but i just feel like let me just give you guys that let me not end this vlog on a sad note so um but i'm not really sad anymore i feel like it's getting my skin is way better than it was last week i couldn't go out like everything was suspended it was that bad so guys definitely check out the ph if you can't see the ph of a product make sure you check it online if it's not there then you don't even buy the product at all because they are shady um yeah i just wanted to come and give my two cents on that because i want to trash this i've not trashed it because i wanted to do this video so i've not trashed. i want to trash it now like throw it in the deepest part of my dustbin that's how bad it is and then tomorrow i'm going to go for a shoot i'm going to take you guys along and then we're going to end the vlog so i hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far make sure you subscribe to me so that you don't miss out on the good stuff and make sure you like this video i'll see you guys tomorrow So I just got to the studio 
the shit is ongoing. And I don't want to make any mistakes. I don't want to be looking at me. But yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Okay. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. <laughs> Chinka.